Kick out the teeth, oh father Every wash we put in a head, oh father Long time them people, they have to go to harder this is the book of Colossians, chapter 2, verse 8. Read. Beware. What he say? Beware. Oh, uh, he warned you. Paul warned you. He said, Beware. Read. Lest any man spoil you through. You. Let, this is like. Beware lest any man spoil you through philosophy and vain deceit. And that's what it happened to the world. You have been spoiled, destroyed through philosophy and vain deceit. The philosophy of what? Religion. The philosophy of Christianity. Because God didn't give you them things. Christ didn't tell you to go in uh, the seventh day of his church. That's nowhere in the Bible. He gave you law, statutes, commandments. Read that again. Be beware lest any man spoil you right. through philosophy and vain deceit. Because the religion of Sunday church is vain deceit. Read. After the tradition of men. After the traditions of men. Because all you have to do is Google that religion and it's going to go back into the time of slavery and show you what men it was. Read. After the rudiments of the world. After the rudiments of the world, we and not and not after Christ. Because that's what you're going. You're going after the rudiments of the world and not after Christ. You got some? We. This is the book of First John, chapter two, verse seven. We. Brethren, I write no new commandment unto you. See that? He said, brethren, I write no new commandments unto you. We. But an old commandment. But the old commandments. Thou shalt love thy brother thyself. Thou shalt not kill. Thou shalt not commit adultery. A man can't lay down with a man. Woman need to put on a dress. Remember the seventh day. Not to bow down the grave and images. No new commandments. Read. Which ye had from the beginning. Which you had had from the beginning. The beginning in Genesis. Exodus. Leviticus. Numbers in Deuteronomy. What you had from the beginning. Read. The old commandment is the word which ye have heard from the beginning. See, the whole commandment is the word which you have heard from the beginning. Give me Matthew 15 and 3. That's right, because we got to get all these ideologies and these philosophies out of our head. This is what got our people destroyed. Because you out here being wicked as hell, but talking about you're a Christian. But you're drinking, getting high, being faggots, being bulldoggers, being whores, adulterers, and adulteress. Come on. That's what you're doing. That part. That part. But you're a Christian, though. Caught up in homosexuality, LGBT. But you're a Christian when God says you don't supposed to participate in those lifestyles. Right. It's an abomination. All right. But you're a Christian, though. We're going to let God be true and every man a liar. Kick out the cheese, oh, father. Maybe watch me for tonight, oh, father. Long time them people, they have a